but that will not just me be, be me solo so you guys don't have to worry there's only about like half an hour or more of me solo if you if you're wondering just wanted to get some more work done on this parliament because it's a big project and the more work i do the faster it'll go oh god i'm carrying lots of stone brick back if this isn't enough to f I shouldn't say that. If this isn't enough to get some significant progress done on it, then I I will be surprised. I forgot how fancy this room is. This room is fancy. There's a lot of a lot of resources used to make it. Alright, gotta get a flag on the side of this building as well to make it look a bit nicer. Back down to the presidential suites. I shouldn't make it too hard to get to, otherwise the president won't want to spend any time down here. So this is where actually the, the thing is going to stop, so let's... Let's make some steps towards putting a light source here. Uh, maybe not here. Make it here. Alright, there's a light source. All right, there you go. Solid, solid as a rock. Everything's working out. And then we can go down just a little bit further. Like I'm not talk. I'm talking like two blocks further, and then we'll. Uh, then we can chuck down a. Then we can start building the actual thing. There'll be two offices and then a presidential office. So. So this is gonna work. So we want it to be about four blocks deeper, I think, right? So no more, no more, this is this is going to be the room now. It can't be two, because that's too small. Three might be just a little bit too small. We'll do four. There we go. Fortunately, there is a vein of gravel, which I hate gravel. Not a huge fan of it. I think it looks a little ugly, but that's not my main gripe with it. My main gripe is it's just... I mean, gripe is it, just like sand, it's just hard to build around. That's why I don't tend to build beach houses. <laughs> Alright, so we'll just clear the whole place out and then forge a room from the ashes of the previous <laughs> of the previous building occupants. Clear the gravel vein out completely, yeah. Don't even don't even worry about what kind of shape this room's gonna be in afterwards, just fuck it. Gravel vein getting cleared is more important. Okay, so the room is going to be about four or five blocks high. Shit, I've, this gravel vein is bigger than I thought it was. Almost done. Yeah, this looks like the last block of gravel. Nice. And we're out of room to store said gravel. Alright, that is a bit high. So we'll do five blocks deep at most here. Don't have a pickaxe on me. So it's one, two, three, four, five. Alright, we'll go up one. This is where the floor is going to be. So we'll start creating ourselves a floor. Uh, do I, want, I don't want to fill in in freaking stone brick. Do I? I, don't know. I guess we have enough stone brick to fill in. Like, I know stone brick is valuable, very valuable, but I mean we have we have a lot of it. Although to be fair, we cleared out a chest on this building already. Almost, well, almost, almost cleared out a whole chest on this building already. Oh shit, that didn't look good. And uh, yeah, we do have. We do. To be fair though, we do have four chests. So. Clearing up a chest might not be that big of a deal. Okay, how long do we want the building to be? So, it'll be two, two. Start with two, and we'll go go this way a bit more because we've got a lot cleared out over there. I'm still going to replace the roof and everything with clean stone because it's man-made, not clean stone, stonework. It's man-made. Again, this will be faster with two people. So maybe I should just wait and get Mashi on here later. Maybe not, though. Maybe I'll just do it now. 
Um, I'm trying to think of how big this original room is going to be because what it's going to be is the what is going to be this 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 main room here, and then over here is going to be a door to the presidential room, and then over here is going to be one office. Over here is going to be another office. So I I don't know if I like this underground thing. Um, if I if I'm asked later to to re renovate it, move it upstairs or something, uh, I'll agree with the idea because. I like the idea of it being underground, it's kind of secretive, it's kind of cool. We'll have like a sand or a flag down here, we'll make it nice and cool. <coughs> but I, I'm not 100% sure it's it, it's presidential enough. I mean, it's underground for fuck's sake. I mean, I'm not sure. Maybe it could be the bunker if, if, uh, if nobody likes the idea of the offices being down here. We'll see. So this original room isn't going to be that big. This is probably enough because we can get more done with the actual offices then. So we'll do we'll go one more this side, one more. So we'll obviously go two more because we'll need a wall. We'll build the room and then we'll build onto it. So that's how it's going to go. TNT might be useful down here if you want. If I want to clear some stuff out faster, and uh, then what we could do is we could just blow a massive hole and then sculpt the square room out of it. Um, <coughs> But uh, TNT, I think, is actually banned, <laughs> legislative-wise. Maybe for miners, it's not. I'm not sure. <coughs> See how it is. See how it is. So it would end. This room is going to end up being in some uh, asymmetrical, not symmetrical, uh, which is fine. The presidential, like my vision of the presidential building, would be more, more than one. Would be two doors to it, but it doesn't have to be. Okay, we get stone brick to the forefront. <coughs> oh, we need a pick pickaxe to the forefront, not a stone brick. Alright, we'll head up. Uh, we'll head up to the chest so we can put some of the stone brick away. Don't need it all right now. Probably don't need the rest of the stone brick for the uh, for the rest of the project. It's probably gonna have some left over at the end, but better to have too much than too little. As I was saying to Marshall at the very first session of this recording session, I wanted him to go and get everything <clears throat> everything he needed right away so he didn't have to go fetching it. Because he got annoyed at that last time. I can't blame him. Fetching shit around is not... <coughs> it's not great. It's not efficient. And uh, it means you lose a builder. Every time you go and fetch stuff, you're not... Not building. It's much more efficient to be building. Okay, I have some chicken on me. Which is good. Alright, down the ladder to the presidential suite. I mean, this isn't going to be like a public building, so it makes sense that a little bit makes it makes a little bit of sense that it's underground. <laughs> Public can't access it every time, all every time they want. Like, well, then again, this is meant to be like the main offices of these guys. These specific three guys are meant to. They're not meant to. Be, you know, they don't have to only be the president and <coughs> the ministers because. Obviously, I mean, that doesn't involve too much work at the end of the day, but uh, if they wanted to be, I think the option should be there to be a full-time politician, full-time government minister. Maybe we should some, provide some sort of government pay for that. But then, yeah, they are the government, so they could probably set that up if they wanted to. Ooh, we struck coal. Yeah, but we'll, we'll mine it. Give it back to the Emperor. Sorry, the Empirical King. Uh, because there's no mining district set. Well, there is. The legislation's been set up, but there's no actual mining district being set up yet, so I think it'd be absolutely legal to, har to farm that stuff. So we'll get up there now. 
Where did we strike it? There it is. Okay. Plus, it's good to get the, all of the coal out of Orion and Imperial City, because, well, I know we won't succeed, because that's a difficult task, but as much as we can, because then there'll be no coal to mine in Imperial City. There's no point in the mine, anyone mining here. I don't think coal is a commodity. Oh no, I've fallen off the edge. That's not good. My keyboard's been on the fritz for a while. I'm not sure <coughs> if it is specifically my keyboard playing up or whether it's some driver software. I did try and I take a while to even like attempt to fix problems. <laughs> that's kinda of, that's just how I do my life, unfortunately. It's not a great strategy. But the other day like so I'd I'd be sitting there like, hmm. A simple thing like updating drivers. I was I'd be sitting there like Hmm, a one solution could be to update my drivers. And then a couple of weeks later I'll be like, okay, let's actually type in and try and get some new drivers for this thing. Uh, and then, of course, the drivers, they're not there, so I'm like, oh, well, I could go looking for some drivers, or I could try and fix my problem, or there's a bunch of stuff I could do, but, you know, I'm not going to bother. So I've sat, so, yeah, my keyboard's on the frets, that's, that's, that's the moral of the story, and I, it's not going to be fixed for for a while, so yeah, you sometimes see me just running into walls or walking aimlessly towards the sunset or something. <coughs> Almost seven o'clock, so record a couple of more minutes, try and get a, a decent, a decent, a decent amount of this room done. Again, like next episode will be a bit more, get a bit more done. Uh, decoratively, because you will have Marshall there upstairs probably decorating the offices while I'm down here trying to finish off this presidential building. Presidential uh, office. So I don't want the president to have one door and the others to have two doors, so I'm going <coughs> to have to make it asymmetrical. Uh, asymmetrical. So, I'm going to have to, yeah, make it not symmetrical so that I can do a single door. <coughs> so, I'll dig one more wall. Out. I'm probably have to gonna do two because I'm going to have to do a wall stone brick behind that to actually do the thing on. Yeah. yeah. My cat is annoying me. Thoroughly annoying me. Go lay down on the sofa. First of all, he tried to jump up onto my lap, even though I'm clearly recording and clearly can't do it. Can't keep him there. He's getting in my way. Then he jumps up onto my desk behind my bloody TV. And he does it all the time. I wish he just knew when we can, when I can, when he can lay on my lap and when he can't. He's it annoys me so much during recordings. No, you can't go on my microphone stand. I'm sorry. Fine. You can sit on my work. That's fine. Go ahead. It's a lot better than my microphone stand. Alright. We are going to have to do a lot of work down here in terms of like getting a lot of this uh, this stone away and replacing it with stone brick but eh, yeah, 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 whatever no no worries I've always wanted to do something underground I've talked a lot about underground cities with the mining district and the uh, uh, and trading district a bunch of ideas for that and uh, an underground presidential f Ugh, voice is really cracking be good to have two hours off. Uh, a good <coughs> underground presidential office would be kind of cool. Ah, I've struck gravel. Damn. Damn. Gotta get 
rid of this gravel vein now. Which is just great. Hate gravel. Hate it. Cause I couldn't just build around it because it's everywhere. And it'll just start falling and ruining things and creating holes. So I'm just going to have to clear the thing out so I know exactly where it is. And again, it is sprawling. It is a sprawling, brawling mess. Oh well. Not too bad, not too bad. Just get rid of it, move on with the building process. Be really into the Minecraft, the Minecrafts lately. It's, uh. Damn. It has been a, uh. A game, a server that I want to—I've been wanting to play for a while. Uh, obviously, a lot of work is going to be going in this month to get ready for the election and facilities that we need, like this. Uh, that's one of the reasons why I've been getting back into it. But another one is just that I've been wanting to play it. Uh, the server specifically, I wanted to make some, make some stuff, be creative. And uh, yeah. It's, that's, it's been what I wanted to do, so I, I just did it. <laughs> I came out and I played. Uh, so we need some cobblestone. We've got some sticks on us. We should do. We created quite a few of them. Guess we didn't. <laughs> Guess I'm wrong. That's it. We're going to need more pickaxes before the end of this project, but that should be enough sticks. Alright, we'll go with uh, five shovels. That's stone brick. That's gravel. I picked up gravel instead of cobblestone. That's just great. And now I've lost my sticks. And now I've lost a torch. Everything's just going great. Everything's coming up, Paddy. Okay, yeah, that won't create too many shovels. I know the theme of the recording session has been Paddy creates too much shit, but no, we're okay. <coughs> we are okay for now. And Paddy go down the hole. Plus a nice outside. I guess it is the middle of the day. The reason why I'm recording today uh, at this time is because, again, just we started recording Parliament earlier, and I thought, yeah, I'm just going to finish it. Going to finish it. Well... I want to finish the building today, of course, but uh, I'm not going to finish it right now, obviously, because uh, there's a lot of decorating to do, a lot of finishing touches to make, and I've only got about half an hour, so I'm uh, I'm not going to finish the entire building today. I'm just going to finish this. Eh, well, actually, no, sorry, I keep getting my words confused. I'm really, I'm, I'm partially tired. That's probably one of the reasons why I. Uh, I'm slurring a bit and getting confused, but uh, yeah, I want to finish the building today, but I'm obviously not going to finish it in this session. What I do want to finish in this session is at least the structure of this this underground facility. All right, so we got that cleared out. So what we act what we're actually trying to do before that gravel appeared what was tr trying to create a wall. Just finish this. <sighs> scares the shit. Just trying to create a wall. Uh, to outline this this opening room. Once we've got that, we know where we're heading. This this is this is this is scary. <laughs> Makes me wonder whether we're going to be getting crashes soon. So, oh, that's the only problem is that this is how big the office is going to be, because. It can't be any bigger because the president's because then it'll cut into the president's office. I should be fine though. This is a reasonable size for an office. <sighs> I I would record more if I didn't have this cat. This this <laughs> this this cat is is annoying sometimes. Alrighty then. Oh, 
almost done with this opening room. And then I, I think I'm just going to end it off. Not much commentary going on here. I'm just digging away, chopping at some stuff. Not really great entertainment. So I, uh, I think I'm going to stop right about here. Uh, we've got an opening room to the presidential suites going on here. So what's basically going to happen is douche. We start building a presidential room, a huge one there. At least reasonably big. It doesn't need to be huge. And then these two are for the foreign affairs and the domestic policy ministers. Alright, I hope you guys enjoyed. I certainly have enjoyed creating some stuff today. I'm going to take a couple of hours break. Go watch uh, the football. Go come back and start recording again with Marshall. So, if you enjoyed, please check out my channel in the description. Uh, sorry, this isn't all I do, by the way. I don't do Minecraft very ever, so... Uh, I apologize for this slow-paced little video here, but yeah, if you want to go check out me, I'm in the description. Uh, if you want to uh, follow this series, make sure you check out the playlist. There is an election for our president on this server uh, taking place on the 28th of December, that's a Sunday. There will be a live stream with live coverage of the election, and uh, we would love to... Uh, it's a parody, mainly, of real-life uh, news during the election days. Uh, if you would like to vote on the election, which we might much appreciate, then please go ahead and uh, then comment and, and message Marshall and, you know, get ready. <laughs> Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time.